So if I wish to set my Osiris Dust Monitor into workplace um, measurement mode, I first need to clear the memory of unit. So if I say start a measurement, it says, do you want to reset the memory? So I say yes and hit enter. This asks me, am I sure? I say yes and enter again. Do I want to start sample one? Well, no, I don't, because I now want to change it to workplace dust monitoring mode. So I say no. And now what I do is I go to edit and enter, and this goes to Zyrus editor, and I scroll across, and I go through operator ID, location, and I go to Zyrus settings and press enter. It now asks me, do I want difference mode? Well, no. Do I want workplace mode? Yes, please. So I say yes to that. Do I want telemetry? No. And now it asks me to set up the uh, measurements I want to take. So I want inhalable? Yes, please. Do I want in micrograms per meter cubed? Yes, please. Thoracic? Yes. Micrograms per meter cubed? Yes. Respirable? Yes. Micrograms per meter cubed? Yes. Do I want PM2 as well? Mm, yeah, I'll go for that. And yes, I want it in micrograms per meter cubed. Now here I can say if I want the unit to store in seconds or minutes. So I want to store every 15 seconds, so I'm going to say yes to seconds. And then all the rest we can forget, so if I press on, that will take me out of there. And if I keep on scrolling across, I can go to storage interval, press enter, and it's set 15 seconds, which is what I set before. Now if I press up and down, I can change this interval. I'm not going to, I'm setting it to 15 seconds, press enter, it's now done. If I press on and reset, that will take me back to the first menu, and now I can take a sample. To take a sample, I just press start, ask me to reset memory, no I don't really want to anymore. Do I want to start a sample? Yes please. Press enter, and we'll start taking the first sample. So it's now going to take the sample and it will just rotate through the different screens of what the current measurements are for particular dusts. So if I want to stop taking a sample, I can go stop. It says, do you want to stop sample one? Yes, please. I press enter, it stops sampling. Now if I want to take a next sample, I can then say start. Do I want to reset the memory? No. Start sample two, yes, please hit enter and it starts again. So away it goes, you'll get your readings again. Now I'm just going to stop this, so stop. Do you want to stop taking sample? Yes. And now I'm done. Now if I want to turn the unit off and download the memory, I press start and the left key. The unit is now off. So to download the Osiris Dust Monitor, you need to use the data download cable, which essentially has the two ends, one USB and one with, uh, I think it's a seven pin. So what you do is you unscrew this top one here. Plug this in. Screw it on. Put this end into your laptop and fire up AirQ web software. So once I've done that, if I turn the Osiris on, it will now start up and won't start sampling. Now all I need to do is connect the AirQ web to the Osiris and download the data from it. So today we're going to take a quick look at downloading the Osiris Dust Monitor. So the first thing that we want to do is add the correct dust monitor. So over here if you enter a 16 digit registration code and add, you can add your dust monitor. And if we then click reconnect, it will open up the COM port associated with that one. You click OK and it's now connected to the dust monitor. So if you now click over to COMS, the first thing you've got to do is stop your dust monitor from sampling or else you can't do anything, so we click stop. Now we can enter the configuration here or we can hit upload to get the results. So I want to get the results, so I hit upload and that's now downloaded the results for me. So if I want to look at the results, I now go to reporter and I select my dust monitor which is TNO3888 and I click the date range and then search. So, 
what do I want value wise so today I'm looking at workplace dust monitoring so if I click everything off that isn't workplace related so I'm looking at respirable, thoracic, inhalable and inhalable again so I then click continue and I get my workplace dust results